how is it going today? Uh, so uh, a couple of videos ago, I did a best of uh, plate style reverbs, including um, the Earthquaker Devices Avalanche Run, the Chase Bliss and Maris CX in 1978, and then the Maris uh, Mercury X here, the most recent of the releases by them, and uh, somebody asked, hey, could you share the settings for the Maris? And I have it titled Avalanche because um, everything was kind of based on what the Avalanche run was sounding like, so I thought we'd just take a quick second and let's uh, let's see what it is. So, um, all right, so uh, I do text mode, uh, text view, because I personally like that better. So you press that once to kind of see what, what's going on. It usually automatically jumps to the reverb, but because I want to show you everything, we're going to go scroll back a bit to the pre-delay. Um, and I'll just get, give this to you piece by piece. So the structure is standard. Feedback is about 27.3%. I've got both the right division and left division off. It's a BBD type, and I have the time at 1500 BPM. Going to page two, 0% uh, cross feed half speed off mod at about 14%, uh, zero dry blend, and the uh, damping and stock reverb. It's an ultra plate mod at 9.4, sorry, the mod depth at 9.4%. Uh, you have decay at 76.6, .6, low frequency at 100, mod speed at 1 hertz, and the high frequency at 74.2%. Uh, reverb, uh, pitch 2, pitch is off, uh, so really a lot of that doesn't matter, but just so you know, the pitch mix is at 68%, diffusion at 100, poly blend at 0. Page 3, all the gate stuff is off. Moving on the dynamics, I have the freeze type on in the pre-dry location, mix at 75, and a gain of 2.5 dB. Preamp is off, filter is off, pitch is off modulation is off. So on this, the mix I have set at 69.5% with a trim both uh, at zero for the dry and wet. And uh, I don't usually do the modifiers uh, for like the LFO stuff uh, yet, but um, because the Mercury X has this fancy hold modifier um, over here, uh, just real quick, um, all of this information is stock minus the I have the latch at latching, not momentary, and the hold assign is the is the freeze, so the dynamic. So like when you hit this, it just kind of goes on forever. So I could stop the little loop that's going on in the background, and you kind of still hear it going. So that's pretty much it. Um, all the other modifiers are as is. I didn't touch them. Expression pedal I don't use. Globals are just the ma main stuff, but um, yeah. I guess technically, if you want to know, the um, the two favorites are the low frequency and high frequency on the reverb, but uh, I didn't assign those that way. That's just how it came, and I just didn't bother to ch change it. So, uh, oh, wow, quick, quick video here, three minutes. Um, hope you got the information you want. I will type it out as well, just so you know what all those details are in the body of this um, description of the video. So, thanks for being here. As always, like, subscribe, comment. Um, and there we go. I hope you have a fantastic day or evening or wherever you are in the world. Peace.